What's up, guys? Um, I know that a lot of you guys, you know, like what I do as far as music goes. And I know you guys love everything that I post up and everything that I do. Like, and I know my music does help you guys a lot. And I'm glad that it does help you guys. I'm glad that you guys do enjoy what I do. But due to the recent events that have gone on with Reborn Records and everybody else that has been harassing me for the last few months, they basically legally are making it to where I have to quit. Um, if you guys go to the video where I called them out on their bullshit and tried to set the record straight, they basically are ruining my career. They're running my name through the mud. Um, I don't want to quit. I really don't. But these people are running my name through the mud in such a bad way that no label or studio will take me on. And... I don't know what the fuck to do. Like, I've tried putting a stop to this guy. I've reported him. I've done everything I could, but this guy just will not stop. He goes by the name Reborn Records, and he also has a couple other channels, too, as well. And this guy's done nothing but belittle me, accuse me of thievery, um, told people that I steal artwork, ruined my reputation and credibility as an artist. He basically ruined my credibility as an artist not only musically but as you guys may or may not know I do a lot of artwork as well I grew up drawing as a kid and you know and I've you know basically took my stuff to the next level like this guy has done so much and damaged my reputation so bad that no label wants to take me on now and it's sad no label is willing to take me now because of this guy He's done nothing but run his mouth about me, talk shit, and fuck up opportunities for me. This guy's fucked up a lot of shit for me. So, Reborn Records, I hope you're watching this. Because I want you to know that you're a piece of shit. You're a sorry excuse for a human being. You go around ruining people's careers like mine. And for what reason? I don't understand. And, you know, let me tell you guys something. All I've ever wanted since day one, all I've ever wanted was to be signed to a good label that will not make me pay to be signed and that will, that will let me do my music my way. That's all I've ever wanted, was to be able to make it a music professionally. But with people like Reborn Records, It's hard for me to do because all he does is run his mouth and talk shit and basically ruins my reputation as an artist and as a musician. And that's not cool with me. Like, I don't understand how this guy can sit there and do this shit. Like, what did I ever do to them? I don't get it. Like, what the fuck did I ever do to them for them to want to run my name through the mud and destroy my reputation? You know, I used to have a really good standing on several, several art sites. Several art sites. I had a real good standing with a lot of people. I had a lot of good standing in the music industry as well. But because of what this man has done, that reputation I once had is basically destroyed. So, I honestly don't know what to do. I mean, if you guys know somebody that's willing to fucking work with me, by all means, send them my way, and I'll sign with them. But they have to be a paying label. Because I'm tired of just sitting here and not getting anywhere. I'm tired of being stuck in the same spot for the last 15 fucking years. I need to get up out of that spot 
and start gaining traction. I need to start getting somewhere with my music. Because otherwise, I'm going to be stuck here in the same spot with a fucked up reputation and nothing to show for it. Granted, musically, I have a lot to show for my hard work. And I'm proud of that. But reputation-wise, my reputation is basically screwed up because of this, man. And it's sad, because I used to have a real good reputation among the music artists, among musicians, and everything. But because of what this man has done, my music career is basically done. Unless I get a label that is willing to fucking work with me, and is willing to help me avoid these guys. Because I've got the skill. I've got the talent. Everybody knows it. Everybody knows I've got the skill and talent to be able to make it. But my question is, is there a label out there willing to fucking work with me and is willing to get me to where I need to be? Because honestly, I can't take much more of this. Because if this shit continues, I will have no choice but to quit music for good. And I don't want that to happen. Something needs to happen. And it needs to happen now or as soon as possible. I can't take much more of this bullshit. I can't take much more of these false accusations and this fucked up bullshit that is getting thrown at me. Because everyone who knows me knows that I'm not a thief. Yes, I use instrumentals off of YouTube. Every artist fucking does it. Every fucking artist. Whether you're a rapper, whether you're a singer, songwriter, every artist in some way uses instrumentals off of YouTube. That's a common known fact. That's literally one of the first things that you learn. But honestly, like I said, unless there's a label that is willing to sit down with me and take me seriously and is willing to fucking work with me, regardless of the fact that I don't have any money right now, you know, unless something gives and there's a legitimate label willing to sign me and is willing to work with me, I'm basically going nowhere. I'm basically going to be stuck. In the same fucked up spot that I've been in for the last 10 years. I'm tired of the false accusations. I'm tired of my reputation being fucked up. Because of these people that are jealous and pissed off at me for whatever fucked up reason. You know, I've worked my ass off to get to where I'm at. And for all that to get ruined by some jealous little fucked up bitch. It's fucked up. Because of this guy, my reputation among the music community and among the art community is basically fucked. Because this guy's got a vendetta against me for whatever fucking reason. This guy's mission is to end my career, and I don't want it to end. I want it to take off. But unless a fucking label comes along and is willing to fucking work with me, regardless of my living situation, and regardless of the fact that I don't have any money, I'm fucked. I just, I don't know what the fuck to do. I really don't. I've tried ignoring this guy. i tried blowing him off. i tried not paying any attention to him, but it just, it doesn't work. Because this guy attacks me from every fucking angle, and I don't know what the fuck to do. You know, I used to have a real good standing in both the art community and the music community. I had a really good standing. But what this guy did, fucking up my career, destroying everything I had, was the worst thing that ever fucking happened to me. Now because of this guy, I'm constantly having to defend my work, having to explain myself. I should never have to do that. My work should be able to speak for itself. I shouldn't have to defend my work. 
But because of what this man did, I'm happy to, and that's not right. So, like I said, unless somebody steps up and gets me signed to a professional, good, legitimate label that is willing to pay me each month or daily, I don't care whether it's for my dubstep work, I don't care whether it's for my metal vocals, I don't care whether it's for my corn style vocals, or even if it's for my classical compositions, I don't care what they sign me for as long as I get signed to a label that is willing to get me away from this bullshit. I'm tired of having to fucking fight everybody. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of having to defend my work, and I'm sick and tired of having to explain myself. And I'm sick and tired of having to fucking ward off idiots like Reborn Records and Blood Records and LMAOXD and X-Ray. I'm sick of it. I shouldn't have to ward off anyone. I shouldn't have to fight. I've had to fight my entire life growing up. I've had to fight for my life every fucking day. I had to fight for my life every fucking day in my life as is. I shouldn't have to do it for my music. Okay? I'm constantly fighting for my life every fucking day as is because of my medical condition. I shouldn't have to fucking fight these guys too. I shouldn't have to do it. And believe it or not, Sam, I have blocked this guy many times over. But this guy keeps on making new accounts and new accounts and just keeps coming at me. So really blocking him doesn't do any fucking good. Like, this guy is literally... He doesn't get it. You know, people don't, people that mess with me just don't get what I go through every day. Because of me being born with one kidney and one and a half lungs, I'm constantly in a fight for my life every fucking day. Because I don't know if my kidney or my lungs can give out at any fucking time. I have to face death every fucking day, but I don't let that stop me. I get up, I face it, and I keep going. I should not have to fight this motherfucker. I shouldn't have to fight anybody. I shouldn't have to defend my work. My work should be allowed to speak for itself. So I'm sorry to say, guys, unless there's a label that comes along and is willing to fucking work with me and pay me for my work, I'm done. I'm not dealing with this shit no more. I'm done fighting. I should not have to fight any longer. I shouldn't have to fucking fight anyone. And if people say I don't get it, oh, I get it. More than you fucking realize, I get it. But what you guys don't get is that I'm not going to bow down to a motherfucker who tries to bash on me for no reason. Or has a vendetta against me. For some stupid shit. And as far as that Gavin B guy goes. Which I know that's who it is. I want you to know something kid. Unlike you and unlike the normal person. Artists like myself. We don't see sites like Rinmaru Games. As a regular game site. We see it as a way to create artwork. We see it as a way to be creative and to create something that people enjoy. You might not see it like that, but everybody else who's an artist gets exactly where I'm coming from. Every artist out there who's like me knows where I'm coming from with that. Because see, normal artists don't think like typical people. We're always thinking, you know, how can we be creative? What can we use to create a really cool piece that people will enjoy? We don't see sites like Grandmaru Games as a way for to play games. We see it as a art creation. 
we see it as a way to create really good artwork. Granted, it not, might not be in your traditional way, but so what? It's still art all the same. And I know that's what you're pissed about. I know you're pissed at me for that. You think that I'm using a game site just to get money. No, that's not it at all. I'm using sites like Renmari Games to make a living off of my art. As well as doing my own abstract art on the side. Like... I don't know what the fuck to do anymore. Like, I'm I'm done. I'm fucking done. I'm tired of fucking fighting. I'm tired of having to fight everybody. I'm sick of fighting everyone around me just to defend my work. I shouldn't have to fight anyone or defend my work. My work should be able to speak for itself. So like I said, unless you guys know a label that is willing to take me on and pay me for my work and to help me out the correct way, then I'm done. I'm tapped out. I can't do no more. I'm tired of fighting. But with that being said, guys, I'm going to hop off here, chill. If any of you guys have anything for me, you guys know where to reach me. I'm out.